Welcome back to the lead, our world lead now. CNN has learned that the long classified portion of a congressional in investigation into the September 11th attacks could soon be made public. I'm talking about the must discussed 28 pages, which are said to contain potential evidence linking officials in Saudi Arabia to the 9-11 terrorists. CNN's Jim Shudo is here with the details. So Jim, uh, President Obama and the Director of National Intelligence, General uh, Jim Clapper, both have said the documents should be released. How soon might we see them? Listen, as soon as tomorrow, you and I might be able to read this on a website from the House and Senate Intelligence Committees. I I'm told that the redacted version, you know, the intelligence agencies have scrubbed it to some degree, although I'm told to a minimal degree, is going to get to the House and Senate Intelligence Committees as soon as today. And tomorrow, once they get through their processes, it might be up on a website then. And, and it's going to be pretty remarkable. I mean, this has been classified for, for 14 years. It's incredible. And, and, and how do the families of 9-11 of victims feel about this? They want it out. They say it should have been out for a long time. The context is, as you, as you know, uh, the Hill is currently debating uh, their right to sue the Saudi government for its alleged involvement. You, you've got a whole group of families represented, ready to go to court, in effect. And here you have documents that, that, that they say could support their case. Uh, listen, I've spoken to folks who've read these documents, uh, classified until tomorrow, and we're all going to get to read them tomorrow. And they say that, granted, these are early leads. This was, this was very early on in the investigation of 9-11. But it does show something about people tied to the Saudi government who had some ties to the 9-11 hijackers. Whether they knew what they were going to do, these are still open questions. And to be fair, the Saudi government has also been in support of this release for some time. Uh, I just spoke to a Saudi government official who said to me, listen, we're happy to have them out there. It's going to show the American people there is no there there. They're happy to have it out there, and they're releasing it on a Friday in July, the same day that Donald Donald Trump is announcing his vice presidential candidate and right before the Republican and Democratic conventions. Could, could, in Washington, could those events possibly be tied? <laughs> Coincidence? It's obvious. I mean, it, it's, a perfect, it's a perfect day to do it. No yeah. question. Yeah. Interesting. Jim Shooter, thanks yeah. so much.